Hello everyone, Mauro here. In this video, we're going to look at the changes that Microsoft have been working on for Windows 11 build 26120.3576 or KV5053650. This preview is available under the dev and beta channels and it is for version 24H2. This video also applies for Windows 11 build 22635.3576. 5090, which is also available in the beta channel, but this is targeted to version 23H2. Okay, let's dive into the changes for this latest preview of Windows 11. But before we subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people, it doesn't cost anything, and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. You can also visit my website for more tutorials and related tech news. Now, as part of this release, Microsoft is making it easier to use voice access. And as part of the changes, the feature now understands voice commands more easily without requiring a fixed syntax. For instance, you can now say, can you open Edge app? And the system will recognize and execute the command to open Microsoft Edge. In the past, you needed to remember a specific syntax. For example, launch Microsoft Edge in order for the system to understand and launch the application. Additionally, voice access now supports simplified Chinese and traditional Chinese. So this is basically the only significant change that Microsoft is officially disclosing in this preview. But unofficially, there is a few other changes in this particular preview. For example, in the start menu, you will now notice that when you right click an app, we will find two more options, including move left and move right. In the past, we only have the move to front option. But always remember that you can always click and drag your application on the position that you want to place it. Now let's go to the settings app and more specifically, let's go to the about page. We had seen in the past that Microsoft has been working on top cards that will show you some key details for components on your computer. And now under device specifications, we are going to find a new frequently asked question section. And this question might vary depending on your system configuration, but you can see here that we have four different questions. And if we click on them, we can see the different answers for those specific questions. So it's just going to give you a little more information about the operating system installed on the computer and the hardware that you currently have. Now, it is important to note that the changes for the start menu and the about page can also be found on Windows 11 build 22635.5090 and the beta channel. Also, these preview builds include some additional fixes and changes. So for more information, check the link in the video description. Also, let me know in the comments what you think about these changes. And remember to like the video, share it. And I just hope this video was informative for you. And I would like to thank you for viewing.